Point number three is that you can distribute booklets or pamphlets on the life of Prophet Muhammad Non-Muslim, what they say about Prophet Muhammad on the seed of the Prophet. You can buy the translation of the glorious Quran and distribute it. Besides sending the PDF file on the internet, on the social media, you can even give a physical copy. It has a different impact. Pamphlets, booklets, translation of the Quran, Islamic books talking about replying to the misconception about Islam. Number four is that you should make a list of the most important people you know and convey this message to them personally. Everyone has some important people that they know. Some people who are celebrities may be knowing ministers, may be knowing other people. Even a normal man living in an apartment, at least he knows the chairman of a society. So what you should do, you should make a list of the top important people that you know who are opinion makers and convey to them this message personally one to one. That has a great impact. And when this issue of the French President Macron came up, I used whatever I could on my social media. Then my wife told me that why don't you convey a message personally to the politicians that you know. And I was quite reluctant saying that you know, most of the politicians will not really take action on it. But my wife said, you should do your duty, leave the rest to Allah. So I went on my mobile in my contacts and just typed ministers and mashallah. There were plenty, there were a few hundred. 30 from one Muslim country, 25 from the other Muslim country, 20 from this country, some are prime ministers, some are home ministers, some are Islamic ministers. And I gave a personalized message depending upon the person and I spent a couple of hours on it. And Alhamdulillah, the result was phenomenal. I never expected such a good result that many of them replied back. Some took action in the next few hours. Some took action after a day. Some took action after two days and they sent me their response, Alhamdulillah. Some wrote directly to the embassy. Some wrote letters on the Facebook, on the Twitter. And Alhamdulillah, it had a great impact. So if every Muslim notes down the important people who they know, it's most important that they know. He may be a local MLA, he may be a member of parliament, he may be a minister, or he may be just a chairman of your society. The top people that you know, if you give a personalized message, it has an impact. Because sometimes you require the Muslims to be awakened. And I've never done this earlier. Yes, I did contact a few ministers many a time, but not at such a large level. And Alhamdulillah, it had a great impact. And many of them replied to me back personally. So the fourth point that should be done is every Muslim, whoever he feels are the most important people he knows, there may be 10, there may be 20, there may be 50, there may be 100. You give them a personalized message whether a phone call, whether a personal SMS, whether a personal message on the WhatsApp, talking about this issue, about this blasphemy and what action should be taken. And believe me, Alhamdulillah, they will be a great impact. Fifth point is that you can put billboards, hire big billboards in important cities and at the main crossroad you can have for a month and put statements of a beloved prophet, the hadith of the prophet, what non-Muslims said about the prophet, statements of important non-Muslim personalities, how they praise the prophet. You can mention verses of the glorious Quran, how Allah praises the prophet. For example, you can mention the verse of the Quran of Surah Kalam, chapter number 68, verse number 4, where Allah says, Verily thou art standeth on the highest standard of character. 
talking about the Prophet. You can mention the verse of the Quran from Surah Azab, chapter number 33, verse number 21, which says, Verily in the Prophet you will find the best example to follow. So by mentioning on the billboards, condemning the act against the Prophet, mentioning the good points about the Prophet, let the world know. Hundreds and thousands of people passing on the street will watch it. You can even be able to read it. You can even put on the buses, posters or banners on the buses. You can even have street plays where you can enact plays defending our Prophet and speaking against the insults against the Prophet. You can have in schools programs and train our children how to have programs in favor of the Prophet. They can have nasheeds 